गुड मॉर्निंग दिस इज डॉक्टर अनुजा सिंह असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ केमिस्ट्री सी के टी कॉलेज न्यू पनवेल सो इन लास्ट वीडियो वी वर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट आर एन एस इक्वेशन एंड कोलिजन थ्योरी सो आर एन एस इक्वेशन हैड सम शॉर्ट कमिंग दैट वॉज एडेड और इम्प्रूव बाय कोलिजन थ्योरी बट कोलिजन थ्योरी हैव सम ऑल्सो ड्रॉबैक्स सम शॉर्ट कमिंग सो दैट वॉज इम्प्रूव बाय आर एन एस RNS activated complex theory or transition state theory of pi molecule reaction so this theory uh, gave a better understanding of activation energy and other uh, uh, things that were not uh, defined by collision theory so according to this theory um, between the state where molecules are reactants and then the state where molecules are products there is a state known as transition state means the transition state is in between the reactant and product means reactant is converting into product so in between a complex used to form that is known as activated complex or transition state complex so this theory considered mainly three main points first is the concentration of the activated complex second the rate at which the activated complex break apart and third the activation how the activation complex break apart means it is converting into the product or it is giving back the reactants so through this diagram try to understand that uh, there is this reactant and it is converting to product so in between in uh, between a complex used to form that is known as activated complex or we can also say it transition state complex so uh, this theory was put forward by ampolent and henry and it includes some thermodynamic concepts so following are the postulates of activated complex theory so first is the all chemical reaction occurred through the formation of an interstate known as activated complex before the reactant get converted into product second it the activated complex is formed by rearrangement of atoms and molecules of the reactant molecules third is this activated complex has some transition existence and hence it is known as transition state complex it exists in the equilibrium between the reactant and product and it has high potential energy then the activated complex decomposes into product and the rate of the reaction is given by the decomposition of the activated complex into product so reactant will convert into activated complex and further it convert to and give us product so here the energy of activation energy is also take role it is the additional energy that a molecule require uh, to convert to form the activated complex so finally the e energy will be given by e a equal to e a c minus e r e a c yani energy of the activated complex and e r is the energy of the reactant molecule so what is activated complex it is also we can say it is the intermediate form during the reaction so this intermediate we cannot uh, identify or we cannot uh, uh, character characterize but it forms during the reactions means uh, there will be the bond breaking and bond forming process will take place so firstly from the reactants the bond will break some bonds will uh, started breaking and it will converted into activated complex then uh, some bond will maybe uh, start forming so then it will activated complex will convert into a react uh, product so it is a bond forming and bond breaking process so uh, the state of particles that is in between the reactant and product that is known as activated complex so activated complex is unstable arrangement of atoms that exist for a moment at the peak of the activation energy barrier because of this high energy the activated complex ex uh, exist for ex extremely short period of time that is about 10 to 13 second inverse and this is equally likelihood that the activated complex either uh, reform the original uh, reactant or goes on to form product so 
uh, further uh, if you see uh, using uh, uh, with the uh, this diagram so there are hydrogen atom and oxygen atom so uh, hydrogen and oxygen uh, atoms come together and they form uh, all uh, activated complex then uh, uh, the bonds will break of hydrogen hydrogen bond and oxygen oxygen bond and it will form water molecule so two water molecules will form as a product so now what is the difference uh, between activated complex theory and collision theory so we know the activated complex theory is the thermodynamic energy uh, which describe the presence of transition state between the reactant and the product while the collision theory describe the progress of chemical reaction through the collision of reactants to form product so if we see the concept wise chemical reaction processes through an activated complex in the transition state and in collision theory the chemical reaction progresses through the collision between reactants having enough kinetic energy and uh, proper orientation if we see the accuracy so activated complex theory give us better result high accuracy of uh, rate of the reaction for any chemical reaction while the collision theory it is low accuracy then uh, name wise it is high and again the collision theory is low so with this i love to conclude the this session thank you